Hello, namaste. It's Kala. Well, you can't make this stuff up. Intention. I was on a wonderful site by a woman named Hiro Boga, H-I-R-O, Hiro Boga, B-O-G-A. You can Google it if I misspelled it, and she's wonderful. She's got an awesome voice, uh, very grounded spiritually, um, teacher and coach, and uh, the real deal. <clears throat> She's run organizations in the real world for decades. Anyway, she has on her site something you might want to check out called Deva Cards. And it's a way to basically flip these cards that are like tarot cards, but they just have one word on them. So, real briefly, I have this intention that I went in, I know I want to manifest. So, I shuffled the cards. You see the back of them. I shuffled a couple times. And my question was basically, how can I manifest this particular outcome that I want? Clicked on a card, flipped over, and it was the word intention. So I just thought that was so funny because I sort of know you need to have clarity on your intention, and it seemed obvious, so I thought it was something else, but Spirit said intention. Then the reason I say you can't make this stuff up, I waited another day and I said, okay, I'm going to, I've thought about it. I'm going to clear on my intention. I am clear. Now that I'm clear on my intention, what do I need to do or know to manifest this particular dream? <laughs> Shuffle the cards multiple times and I get willingness. So, I mean, to me, they just make perfect sense. So willingness. So it's my own intention and then my own willingness to have this manifest. And I just find that really profound. I wanted to share that with you. That when we say there's something we want, are we clear in our intention? And I know that that's a key. But the other piece that was still obviously stumping me was, am I willing? So are you willing to have in your life what it is that you say that you want? I thought that was a profound profound spiritual response. Have a blessed day. Bye-bye.